when I met him, uh, I looked at him and he, uh, well, there's, it just came to me like this, that this is the son of man that the Bible say that will uh, prophesy that will come in the last days of the world, and that uh, I couldn't get that out of me. And I shook hands with him, and I said to him, I said, you are the one that the Bible prophesies that will come at the end of the world under the name Son of Man and under the name the Second Coming of Jesus. And so he looked at me a little stern, and then he smiled, and he put his head down to my uh, beside my head then whispered in my ear and said these words. He said, yes, I am the one, but who knows that uh, but yourself? And uh, be quiet. His mother, he says, was a white woman, and uh, his father was a black man. Yes, sir. He taught <coughs> us that... Uh, he was born in Mecca, Arabia, and that uh, he <coughs> had come in and out of this country for about 20 years before ever that uh, he made himself known to us. He had uh, studied, he says, out here, or rather he... Uh, had uh, enrolled in the California University there, and he lived with the white family out there, he says, while he was going to the University of California. How long he went uh, to this uh, university, I don't know. But he says to me uh, that he did go to this university and enrolled there. And other universities he mentioned to me, and finally he told me this, that he had studied every uh, uh, educational systems of the civilized world, and that uh, he could speak, and, well, speak 16 languages and write 10 of them. He could speak 16 fluently. The, uh... Well, I was not too much going into scripture at that time, and uh, I had not studied too much, but I had, from a child up, wanted to uh, learn the scripture, because my father was a preacher, and I always, from a child up, wanted to uh, help him or take his place one day as a preacher. And so... I was always studying the Bible, and I had uh, read much about the coming of the judgment and the coming of God and uh, Jesus returning uh, to uh, resurrect the dead and all like that. I had studied much of that. And uh, so all of his talk and teachings correspond with what I had learned of the scripture. And therefore, I become one of his, uh, uh, I, I should say, 100% convert. And on his uh, uh, leave of us, he began to tell me what uh, I may expect, what will come to pass, and what I should do to try and uh, make my people qualified, or rather to reform them, and make them acceptable by the Islamic people and uh, teach them that they must change completely uh, in the way of righteousness and uh, that they would have to forego the name that they was in and that he would give them all a name himself. And uh, much he said, much he said, to me. He used to teach me uh, night and day. We used to sit sometime 
from uh, early part of the night until sunrise and after sunrise. All night long, for about two years or more, he was with us three years, a little better, and uh, I was constantly around him, and he was constantly teaching me of uh, things to, of Islam and, and what is to come and what was before. And uh, this is the way that we begin. <laughs> 